After a few grueling practices, the 2015 Cincinnati Cyclones training camp is now in full swing. Every day, players work together to build a team while also fighting to earn a spot on that 21-man roster. Part of camp is, you know, getting better each and every day as a team and uh, starting to develop some chemistry with your teammates, whether it's your line mates or going through some systems. But, you know, I think guys are excited to get the regular season going. We still got another week or so before they'll trim it down to our final roster. The biggest thing I kind of try to do is make an impact every day. Um, that's one thing you got to get noticed. So whether it's, you know, a, a five on five drill or even, you know, a shootout, simple, simple drills, just try to make an impact so coaches see you. I want to see the individual skills, the individual mindsets, the player in general, what he brings to a team and if he's going to fit the piece of the puzzle that we need. See if guys have learned, if they understand the systems, if they've developed that hockey sense, that they have that hockey IQ to be able to read and react. we got to see that guys want it and the guys want to make a statement to be on this team. And, you know, there's positions to be had right here. And there's nothing set in stone on any spot, any line, any any position at all so it's going to be interesting to see because I think a lot of guys want to prove that they belong here and, and I'm, I'm excited to see it happen. You're in a good spot right now. I like the way you're really playing. I really do because I want to hear you talk. Okay? They'll help you out a ton with these guys. All right? Midway through camp, the Cyclones have a home-and-home preseason series with the Wheeling Nailers starting with a game at U.S. Bank Arena. Wheeling is a tough team to play against. They always have that, uh, you know, hard power forward uh, mentality on every player, whether they're a big or small guy. You know, the, you know you're going to get hit, and uh, and that that's the the kind of game they play. So we're going to have to amp it up tonight and and match that and use what we got. You know, we got a lot of skill and speed on this team, so it's going to be a good game. You know, to say I came into this thing, you know, not nervous would be a lie, but. After a week of practice, you know, Max put us through some good competition and practice with some inner squad scrimmaging and stuff. So I'm just waiting for the opportunity Friday. Really excited just to show my game, you know, and make that impact on the team. Okay, boys, let's get into it earlier here, eh? Lots of talk again. Communication's going to be big. Get the pucks moving north. Lots of shots, all right? Whatever you do, show it tonight. Okay, if you're a grinder, grind. Hit or hit. Shoot or shoot, all right? All the little things tonight. Let's have some fun out there, boys. Get back going in here in some games, okay? We're a little slow at the start there, but that's to be expected in the first exhibition game. A lot of guys have been going through a tough training camp here, and legs are maybe a little heavy to start, but I thought we found our game well, and we got better as the game went on, which is important. Support that puck. Be an option. Weak side D. That puck goes around. Be active down the walls. We better have an F3. Okay, we're letting the break out too easy. Sometimes you can see if it's a tougher game or it's things aren't going your way, you can see the looks on guys' faces at where it's right when the momentum's about to change. It's important to kind of keep guys on an even keel and, and make sure everybody's in the same frame of mind. The first period was a little bit of a, you know, a <laughs> little all over the place, but we sorted it out as a team and you can see the chemistry building even just after one game throughout that. That second and third period is really good. When you guys started selling in as the period went on, it was, there was a lot of pretty plays out there, nice things to see, okay? So the one thing for sure is passing. Let's concentrate on our passes, all right? When you guys are putting them tape to tape, you saw the momentum we could get going, okay? When you guys are f***ing around with it and missing passes, everything else, okay, then they get the momentum. Momentum is a funny thing. You'll hear me talk a lot about it throughout the year, and I'll start it now. It's something you don't see, but you feel it. And when you have it, it's awesome. When you don't have it, you know you don't have it, okay? Calm down, boys, okay? Start having some fun out here. Let's get going. Have another good period. Same start. It's early, obviously, it's very early, so um, systems and getting comfortable with each other will come, I think, in the future, but today was good. I thought we got to see a lot of how each other plays. Get a stick. Don't make it easy on guys down there. Make it hard. I played pretty well. I, you know, it's nice to get a goal out of the way early and, you know, get that off your back. I know it's preseason, but it always feels good to bury one, and, and it's nice to get that out of the way. Viney took a shot from the point there, and Perry actually blocked it and bounced off him, and, Kind of, I was just cruising out from the corner and whacked away at the rebound and put her in there. Talk it out. Believe me, everything will get eliminated, all right? Just got to stop, play your position, tough down low, finish guys. We got a power play here for a minute and a half. Let's get that thing buzzing, get that momentum going, and let's have a great period, boys. They're usually a really, really tough team to play against, and I, f I feel like they didn't have their best lineup, and it's usually a lot tougher during the season, but it's nice to get the preseason game as a win, and, and we're going to build off of it. Yogi can't do it that smooth. You can't even do it that smooth. Good job there, guys, eh? Kind of came as we went there, which we knew would happen. Everybody did a great job. Good job. For me, that's one of my favorite parts of winning is the locker room afterwards. So I think we have a fun, we have a fun group, and uh, we, should, uh, we should enjoy this year.
The Cyclones followed up that 6-1 victory at home with a come-from-behind 4-2 win on the road to sweep the preseason series from Wheeling. We weren't playing a lot of our regular guys, and uh, a lot of our younger players responded uh, really, really well. They came out, played hard for three periods, did all the extra things that it takes to win on the road. We still have a lot of work ahead of us uh, systematically, but um, when it comes to the guys and what they did out on the ice, I can't complain. They all put their best foot forward and they worked as hard as they could and showed us what they got.